How you doing? This is Reggie Lanty with Body Defining LLC, a health, wellness, and fitness company where we specialize in personal training, massage therapy, and sports-specific coaching. Today we'll be talking about how to take waist and neck measurements to determine body fat. So when you're taking your waist and neck measurement to determine your body fat, there's actually three numbers for men that you need and four numbers for women that you need. So for men, what you need to do is you need to take the measurement around your neck underneath your Adam's apple, that's one. You need your height in inches and you also need your waist measurement around your belly button. Now you wanna make sure that the, when you take the measurement, it is level going all the way around every site that you're taking. For women, you need the neck measurement underneath the Adam's apple. You need the waist measurement, but it's a different location for the waist measurement. The waist measurement is in between the sternum and the belly button because you want the smallest part of the waist for women. And then you also need the hips and then the woman's height to get your measurements. When you get these numbers in inches, what you need to do is you need to go to dietandfitnesstoday.com input these measurements into their calculator and it will determine what your body fat percentage is. In order to record these measurements, you would need a tape measure. Now, when you record each measurement, you wanna round it to the nearest half of an inch. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your tape measure, you're gonna wrap it around your neck, underneath your Adam's apple, and you're going to record this number, all right? So when you record that number, then you move to the next side. We're demonstrating for men right now. So what you want to do is you want to take it, you want to put it around your waist, across your belly button, making sure that the band is even all the way around. Now what you want to do is you want to make sure that you exhale so that you get the widest measurement possible. You record that measurement and then for men all you need to do is input your height in inches and then that, and it will give you your measurement for your body fat. For women, you have the same neck placement right here. Then what you want to do is you want to take from your belly button and your sternum, you want to find the middle point, wrap the tape measure around. Once you wrap it around, you also want to exhale and record your measurement. Now you want to take your hip measurement, you want to have your feet together, the widest part of your hips, making sure that it's even all the way around, and you want to record that measurement, and then you want to add your height, and you want to input it at the website, dietandfitnesstoday.com, in order to input your numbers in inches or centimeters in order for you to receive your body fat percentage. Now you may want to get the help of somebody else to take your measurements so that it's easier and you get more accurate numbers. This is Reggie Lamptey with Body Defining, a health, wellness, and fitness company where we specialize in personal training, massage therapy, and sports-specific coaching. You can find us on the web at www.bodydefining.com.